This is Chris from Record Talk. So we're doing Randall Weaver's Start Me Up contest today. So, look, I'm wearing shorts. Sometimes I sleep in them. If that counts as pajamas, yay. If not, oh well. So, um, let's talk about his contest. So, uh, first of all, um, I've been paying more attention to his channel recently. He has some pretty good taste in music, a lot of 80s and 90s stuff that I like. So that's pretty cool. And so he kind of wanted us to show music that starts us up, sort of stuff we would listen to in the morning. And I kind of, I'm going with a theme of like different parts of my life. Okay, so let's say I was in high school. I'd be on the school bus in the morning. I'd be wearing my cheap Walkman knockoff because I didn't like most of the other kids on the bus. And I'd be listening to, uh, maybe I'd be listening to ACDC, Back in Black. Or maybe some Van Halen, maybe some Van Halen 1984. So this is the sort of stuff I would have been listening to when I was like, oh, 15, 16. Um, chilling in the back of the school bus, uh, hating the world. So then I got to college. And um, so um, maybe we get a little bit more grungy. Some early sound garden. We've got Loud Love, I Awake on this album, uh, Big Dumb Sex, uh, L7, Smell the Magic, Shove, Fast as Frightening, Right On Through, Till the Wheels Fall Off. This is some pretty loud, aggressive, fast music. That'd be good for waking up to. And then I had my Ski Bump era, and I remember um, we had a... Um, I was in Colorado. Um, we were, um, I uh, had a job where we were cleaning condos and my roommate at the time, um, I don't have the insert for this guy anymore, but he would listen to Rage Against the Machine every fucking morning. Wake up, killing in the name of. Fuck you, I won't do what you tell me. Fuck you, I won't do what you tell me. I mean, I like Rage Against the Machine, but uh, I needed a few years off it after I wasn't living with that guy anymore. I'm missing the front insert. I really badly need an upgrade on my Rage uh, debut album. Um, but then when I wasn't living with that guy anymore and I was working evenings at a nice restaurant uh, so we could get up in the morning, we could go skiing, we had some time to wake and bake, so we would listen to something a little bit mellower, some fish, rift, um, rift, lengthwise, maze, um, that sort of stuff. So some waking and baking in the 90s with fish. Then I went to graduate school and maybe I would be listening to some Radiohead, OK Computer, uh, some Paranoid Android, some Karma Police, um, then early 2000s, I'm a young professor, uh, I like the White Stripes, uh, One More Cup of Coffee is one of the songs on the White Stripes debut. I know I'm showing a lot of CDs, but I'm not usually using a turntable early in the morning. Oh, but maybe we would listen to some System of a Down. Um, to get you going early in the morning. Uh, we could listen to some sugar. We could listen to some spiders, uh, some sweet peas. Um, now that I'm an old man, uh, what am I going to listen to on those uh, weekend mornings? I might get up and listen to some jazz, maybe some Miles Davis, some Bitches Brew. Or maybe I'll jam to some Bob Marley and the Wailers. Uh, Wake Up and Live. There's a song on here called One Drop, which isn't about coffee. And then, oh, finally, um, Made in China, Stay Awake. Cheers.